Welcome, I'm Tom McLaughlin, the Executive Director for Ecolite Medical US. Ecolite is a company based out of Italy that has now made the commitment to come to the US so that we can have this technology, the REMS technology, put into the physician's care so that they can bring this new technology into the patient. I'm Dr. Evan McLaughlin. I'm a fellow of the American College of Rheumatology and I'm a certified clinical densitometrist. In fact, I was one of the first 90 clinical certified densitometrists in the United States. Having been in this field a long time, some very interesting points about this machine. A bone density machine, a DEXA scan, gobbles up an entire exam room. This machine doesn't gobble up anything. It's either on a cart that rolls around or in a, a small container that has a handle. So therefore, it has virtually zero space requirement. It does take a certain amount of strength to lift it. You know, and it's a fairly bulky case, but the fact is, it easily, easily pops in the trunk and you can carry it in. You can put it on a cart if you don't want to carry it. So that means it can go to where the patient is. And this can be especially useful in areas where there is an access to care issue where people perhaps wouldn't go a distance to the testing center. So now you can bring the machine to them. We're excited to bring the Echo Station into the U.S. market, especially with our physician partners, where they can go and scan patients radiation free and have the ability to give bone quality and bone density to their patients in a quick 20 minute study. We always think that even though the radiation with DEXA is low, it's still radiation and all radiation is bad. There's nothing good to say about radiation. And so the less you have per lifetime, the better. And since radiation dosing is cumulative, the less dose we give you, obviously that's an advantage. The fact that Echolite does not use radiation, it's an ultrasound based machine it does not need to be used with the assistance of a radiologic technologist. It can be used by someone in the office or in the hospital that we can teach to be able to do good scans and get quality assessments of the patient's bones. In DEXA scan, we try to use, for best practices, the same technologist of the same machine. That's not always possible, it skews the results. This machine blows past that. They've already studied technologists and non-technologists, highly trained technologists, lesser trained people, and the results were essentially the same. So the accuracy of the machine and the internal software eliminates the need for that level of expertise to get a valid study from this machine. You can use one machine for one study and a different machine for the next study. So if the patient moves and wherever they go in the future, they can get a scan that's still valid. If they've moved to your area, you can still do a test. Why would a health professional consider this? First of all, the fundamental flaw in bone densitometry on DEXA is it measures bone quantity, not quality. The only machines we've had that measure quality in the past were peripheral ultrasound machines that did not correlate with hip and spine where the fractures occur. So this is a breakthrough technology for that reason. That alone should interest people. In addition, it takes a lot of training to read a bone density correctly. It doesn't take nearly as much training to read this test correctly. If your patients might tend to move, when they move you can still do this on a different machine, unlike the same machine with bone densitometry or on a DEXA scanner. You don't need the same technologies. So many of the barriers and challenges are swept away. And in a European study, this technology was more predictive of future fracture than was DEXA. That to me is a very significant issue. So I think the average provider should be very interested in exploring this technology, learning about it, and deciding whether it's right for their practice. Bone health is a serious problem here in the U.S. We feel that the Echo Station and the way we do ultrasound-based bone density scanning will help improve the patient's life by giving them the answers of what their bone health is. My job is to save people from the devastating effects of fragility fracture. If I have a, a woman who's healthy, age 50, during her lifetime, she has a one in two chance of a fragility fracture, one in two, 50%. Men don't get away, they're about 33%. One out of three men will eventually have a fragility fracture. I wanna stop that. And here's this, what I regard as this breakthrough technology to lead us into the future. I would ask someone why they wouldn't consider it, rather than why they would consider it.